Hey guys, this is Sprite Dude here again for a third round, and my today's topic is going to be on a user named Sky Performance. And yes, this is my first time making a rant on a bad user. Before I begin this rant, to anyone who still has ties on him, I'm sorry to say this, but I suggest you guys to cut ties with him for what he has done. And no, I'm not forcing your opinions, I'm just giving you guys an convincement. And also, I'm only giving constructive criticism to this person, so don't raid this user or anyone else who are mentioned on this video. I highly recommend you to ignore him since he's not worth your time. Anyways, let's convince this rent. Before I'm going to tell you the reasons why Sky Performance is no longer trustworthy, I'm gonna to do the introduction to him. Sky Performance is a Romanian user who currently has 4,000 subscribers. His main focus is on preview to deepfake videos, which is dominated on his main channel, until he got terminated a year ago. But on October 19th of this year, he managed to get his main channel back. Not only that, he also has two other channels named Sky Performance is back and Sky Performance the second. Since I introduced Sky Performance to you guys, I'm going to tell you the reasons why he's not trustworthy anymore. Reason 1, he can't handle hate or being criticized by someone. Reason 2, he has an unhealthy obsession on a preschool character owned by Wild Brain named Caillou. He even attacks people who are making Kai You Gets Grounded series, and what's even crazy is that he also forced people to stop making Kai You Gets Grounded. In my true honest opinion, he could have minded his own business, but no, he attacked other users over a fictional character getting grounded. And just letting you know, it's other users' choice whether or not make Kai You Gets Grounded. Reason 3, you guys might not heard this. But I think Sky Performance is an actual troll feeder just like the Master Anomius 92, but unlike Anomius, he doesn't do troll feeding as much. But have you wonder why Sky Performance is a troll feeder? Well, that's because he made a video called How Sam Paul the Second Sings that was made back in April 27th of last year. And it's a video where Sam Paul the second sings a copyright music that I have to mute it to avoid my video to be taken down. Not only that, he did the same thing to Yather Ellie, who's probably now a dead topic. I know that Sam Paul the second and Yather Ellie can't be trusted, but he should realize that trolls are meant to be ignored, and they're not meant to be taken seriously, and so does dead topics as well. Reason 4. Sky Performance is both racist and a flag disrespecter. If you guys don't know, he made a post where he burned the flags of Indonesia and Ireland, but he deleted that post to avoid backlash. That shows that not only that he offended 283,488,000 people who are in Indonesia and 5,380,300 people who are in Ireland and being heartless, it also shows him that he also ruined my good friend's part of ER's reputation since he's from Ireland. Reason 5. Sky Performance has his own channel rules. Well, there's technically nothing wrong with channel rules, but it shows him hypocrisy when it comes to that, I guess. But I decided to go over some of his rules on his main channel. On one of his rules, he made a rule that you shouldn't destroy him. And he made another rule where you shouldn't rant on him, when it's actually too late for him to stop this situation since a lot of users made a lot of rants about him for his wrong decisions that he has made since last year. And there's another rule that you shouldn't jump scare him. What? Aren't you afraid of Springtrap speaking your dang soul at 4 a.m.? And final rule that I'm going to point out is that he made a rule where you have to salute on Sky Performance himself, but if you didn't make a salute on him, he claims that you could get arrested for not saluting on him. And to be honest, this has got to be a dullest rule that he has putted on his channel. And that's because not saluting on someone isn't a crime at all, and it doesn't even count as a felony since not all of us has to salute on Sky Performance. And that proves he's an opinion forcer. Reason 6, 
Not only that he disrespects flags, I also found out that Sky Performance said the N-word to Pril Mohammed Comedy World on Greenthorn the Geometry Dasher 276 is stream. That's racist, you can't say the N-word! I'm now very dissatisfied and disappointed at him for offending 1.2 billion black people around the world, including my favorite Goanimator, LJ the Cool Goanimator Boy 2009 and Armless Zinbar. Now you can clearly tell that Sky Performance is racist once again. Reason 7, he's a stalker just like Min Kang the Goanimator, even though I'm still ignoring him. One of the two examples are that he stalked USAP and Kun the Digimon and Five Nights at Freddy's Fan 2010 and SAB64 by subscribing to them when the both of them aren't trusting him for his wrong decisions. And just to let you know, stalking someone count as third-degree felony, and he could have faced sentence behind bars for two to ten years and pay a fine of ten thousand dollars. Reason eight, he basically stole two Epic for You's avatar. Every user knew this since two Epic for You created his avatar back in 2020. Meanwhile, Sky Performance stole his avatar back in June of last year. You can literally tell that Sky Performance is an avatar thief just like Sam Paul II. And finally, reason 9. The worst thing that Sky Performance ever did was that he attempted to hack Biaria's account. Okay, first of all, he's not even freaking tubers 93. And second of all, hacking counts as class B misdemeanor, and he could have been sentenced up to 180 days behind bars and paid the fine of $2,000. And this is exactly why Sky Performance can't be trustworthy anymore. So, in conclusion, we learned that Sky Performance can't tolerate being criticized, and also learned that he troll feeds Sam Paul the second when he was a troll, going over some of his rules on his main channel, and more wrong decisions that makes him a degenerate. And I really think that Sky Performance should admit his wrongdoings, and making sure that it might be accepted or denied. And I'll see if I give Sky Performance another chance or not. But if he keeps doing these types of wrong decisions, then I would be ignoring him at all times. But anyways, this concludes my rant. If you guys spot another wrong decision that Sky Performance has made, comment down below. Also, shout out to LJ, the cool go animator boy 2009. Blue Nebula Boy, SAB64, UCP and Kun the Digimon and Five Nights at Freddy's Fan 2010, Greenthorn the Geometry Dasher 276, and more users for many reasons and evidences about him. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed my today's rant. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel. And next time, I'll be ranting on Angry Birds Block Quest. And then I'll rant on Little Brown Bear, a show that people on the internet has hatred towards it recently. And then it will be on Lunchly, after that it will be on Skibidi Toilet. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next rant video. This is Sprited Dude, over and out.